Hey fam, welcome back to my channel. If you're joining me for the first time, my name is Chef Fran. But first, give me a virtual hug by hitting the subscribe button. And in return, I will give you a new recipe every week. Well, want to feel the tropics, want to have the taste of the tropics? Let's make some pina colada smoothie. You heard me, pina colada smoothie, virgin though. All right, so I'm gonna add some coconut milk here pineapple. I'm going to add some cream de coco. It's going to give it that nice sweetness taste. I'm going to put a frozen vanilla yogurt ball in here. And I'm going to add for a little thickness and health, you know, some oatmeal. About three tablespoons of oatmeal. Oh, three and a half. A little bit of ice here. Just a little bit of ice. Here's our vitamin content. Here's our pina colada smoothie. Look how nice and thick and creamy that looks. Nice and creamy and thick. Yum. And we're gonna top it with some toasted coconut. And here are our list of ingredients. Well, Gio's our resident taste tester and he's gonna taste the pina colada and let us know how good it tastes. Cause um, it sure smells good. G, taste for us and let us know how it is. Well, it tastes exactly like how you would expect a pina colada to taste on a hot summer day, you know. Well, I can't wait to try this. Well, I have to tell you, mm, I have to take another sip because this just tastes just like you are having a pina colada on the beach. Doesn't it, Gio? So this is non-alcoholic. Um, I don't know if people put alcohol in their smoothie, but it tastes just like, you know, the thing that you would actually get like at a restaurant or whatever. Um, it's not overly sweet though. That's the only thing. It's not as sweet because you know when you have frozen fruit, the natural sweetness of the fruit kind of dies down from the ice that's in it. But it's just perfect for Gio and I. So if you find that it's not as sweet, you could put like, you know, other things to kind of sweeten it of your preference that you may like. But it's perfect for us. And if you want to put alcohol in it, honey, you're grown. You do what you want. If so make this and let me know how it worked out for you and come back and hang out with us in our next video. And remember, be good to yourself and God bless you.